Hello everyone, welcome to Crafting and Cruising. I'm Lisa and we are in an antique store in North Carolina getting ready to begin our trek home. And so I thought you guys might like to see what we have here. So I've turned the camera. When you get on, say hi. And if you watch the replay, please let me know you watch the replay. Um, so let's see what we find in here. Forgot to put my phone on Do Not Disturb, so I may get disturbed. This looks like a cute booth. So how's everybody doing today? Hope you're doing great. Look at this. I understand the concept of cooking and cleaning, just not as it applies to me. Uh, love it. Lots of little minis here. This is pretty. That would be pretty on a Easter project. I might have to get that. That's just four dollars. I like that. Excuse me, little bunny. Sorry, y'all. Some more little minis look like Hummels. I think they probably are. Hey, Donna Harrison, how are you this morning? Hope you're doing great. I woke up with a terrible headache, so I did take some medicine, and um, hopefully that'll help. Look at these Mary Englebright calendars. <gasps> you guys, how cute. You know who would love these? Is um, Chris Hunter. Oh, um, my word. I may have to get these. Ronnie, will you put these in my buggy? Yeah, I'm going to get those. I can use them as giveaways, too. I can use those as giveaways. Chris Hunter will have a fit. Okay, let's see. 60% off everything. Fall customer appreciation sale. Y'all tell me if you see something you just have to have. Tonight, I'm going to be working on a cute little Easter project that I've already started doing some prep on. Would you, and I'm, would you like a chaw of tobacco? Yes, please. Put your, put your twist of tobacco in there. We'll cut your chaw off right there. Okay, thank you, sir. Um, could you also put somebody's finger in there? Oh, yeah. Okay. Other things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you hear that? Ooh. Um, anyway, I'll start doing some prep for my... Easter craft tonight, but I need to do a little more prep as we're traveling, not only to cut down on time tonight, but also, oh my gosh, I love that cabinet, but also, um, because, oh, that's $795, you guys, that's ridiculous, that's probably why I'm still sitting here. Um, but also because I need for it to dry since I forgot my heat tool. Yes, sir. The seventies called, they want their furniture back. Oh, okay. Well, maybe we can take some of this home to use for Tanya's birthday party. Guess not. Hey, Carol Haynes, how are you? Glad you're watching with us. We're in an antique store. We just came in. And um, the things I have picked up so far are not too badly priced, but some of the things I've seen, like this mirror, two thousand dollars. I'll be taking that home today. So I'm trying not to go too fast because I know when you're watching a video and people are going too fast, it makes you dizzy. Does me anyway. So. 50% off all books. I don't need any books today. This place is big. My dream has always been. Donna Harrison said hi, Robin. Who did? Donna Harrison. Here you are. Y'all, if, if it happens again, just hang on. I'll try to come back. I lost their drawers. <laughs> Ronnie said somebody lost their drawers. Uh, um... I don't even know what I was saying there. 
That's not even too important. Excuse the mess. Oh, that's okay. We sold furniture and we're bringing in furniture. My husband said somebody lost their drawers. <laughs> <laughs> not lately, but. <laughs> Oh, look, this is cute. You are my sunshine. I love that. My grandmother used to sing that to me when um, she was rocking me to sleep. The four stages of life. You believe in Santa Claus. You don't believe in Santa Claus. You are Santa Claus. You look like Santa Claus. Ugh. Now, this is for all my friends on here. It's the friends we meet along the way that help us appreciate the journey. I love that. Some neat watches, stock watches. I mean, pocket watches, that's what I meant. Yeah. Oh, what I started to say a while ago was hey, Micheline, my sweet friend. Um, my dream has always been to have a place like this. What? So you can go through there because I got a back up. Oh, out, stuck. Um, where I could have like different booths for people to rent space, but then I could also have like a uh, place for artists to come in and teach classes for children and or adults, and then have like a coffee shop, coffee bar area where if parents brought their children to come to a class then they could sit and have a pastry and a coffee or whatever so um, that's always been my dream um, Rodney Rodney okay, now if I, have to trash I need one of these for my for our motor home I need this one instead of that electric one Look at this cabinet, you guys. This is awesome. I used some of these wooden shoes before. I've taken them and covered them in jewels to use as bookends. That would be so cool. You would do well with it. That's my kind of place to visit. I know, mine too, Micheline. I'm too old now to probably do it, plus rent. If you can find any empty buildings around Nashville, crazy expensive. Crazy. But every time I go in one like this, I say to Rodney if he's with me, or I think to myself, see, this is what I always wanted and never had. Kind of makes me sad. <clears throat> that is a big clock right there, girls. So anyway, Later on, watch for my telegram, and I'll, I'll post it on my page, too. I am going to be going live to do a portion for tonight. This is cool. Classic gift wraps. What? I don't understand. Oh, look at the designs. <gasps> Those would be pretty. 16 full color tear out sheets. Each sheet opens to 18 and 3 quarters by 27 inches. 20 gift labels, gift wrapping suggestions, duplicate patterns. They've got that one. They've got this one. This is two for eight. That's not too bad. Or five dollars each. Oh, those are pretty. And then they've got Art Nouveau. See what those are. Wow. Don't you think we could um decoupage with those? I love these. I love these florals. Mm -hmm. I know I, I, it, it was going in and out a while ago, Micheline. So I'm just doing the best I can. And if it goes out and stays out for a long time, I'll just see you all when I come on live later. But when it went out before, I just waited for a while and it came back. 
freaking boho. That's cute. Look at this retro dresser. Oh, cute. $425. Now that's not bad. That is adorable. Love it. Old suitcases. Look at the bunny rabbit. I wish we lived closer to Mission Lane. I really do. Look at that sweet baby. Not for sale, it says. Display only. Love this rug. I think Rodney got way ahead of me. Way ahead of me. Let's see. Lots of knives and jewelry. I need to do another shadow box. Um, seventy dollars. No, thank you. No, thank you. Now, which one do I go? <laughs> I think I'll just go straight back. Lots and lots of estate jewelry. I'm sure very expensive, especially in an antique store. Um, we are in Greensboro, North Carolina. Close to um, High Point, and we're slowly making our trek back home. I think Rodney's actually finished with his jobs that we came here for. Look at the chandeliers, mm -mm -mm. albums. My grandmother used to have a collection of these old shoes. Aren't they so sweet? Man, if I just had some of her stuff back. It's a pretty Fabergé type egg. I think the Sparkle Six or some, no, maybe not just the Sparkle Six, but in the Sparkle Room, they're gonna um, do some eggs coming up soon. I saw that. Um, Somebody's page, I don't remember who. Yeah, let's look at the color. Mm -mm -mm. So cool. Y'all know I'm a jewelry freak. And I need no more. That wouldn't stop me from buying some if I saw some I like that was reasonably priced. Hi, Evangeline. How are you? I'm in an antique store. Look at this cute little bag. In North Carolina. $27.50. Thought I'd take y'all along for the visit. Just seeing what all they have. Most of it's too expensive for me. Do you see anything cool back there? What? I was trying to decide which way to go. On part and stuff. Where is it? Okay. He said he found steampunk art. It used to be very popular. I don't know if it's so popular anymore. What'd you say? Don't look in there at those turquoise color things. <laughs> He told me not to look in here at this turquoise necklace. He knows me well. Let's see. Some of these booths are having sales, but I've decided in a lot of these places, what they do is they jack the price up first so that when it goes on sale, it looks like it's a really good deal. Huh. Mm. If I had a booth of my own, I might do that too, but it's a cool tray back here, two of them. They're glass. What does that say? Ironstone platter, $65. I like to go thrifting more than I do antiquing because when you're going thrifting, you can usually find stuff that is lesser priced. Good clock out of the dice. Mm, I love the 
those shutters. I have a shutter on either side of my large windows in my den area, and I hang pictures on them, or paintings, and I just love it. I think the look is so cool. Okay, let's go another direction. I didn't see anything that way that just jumped out at me. So we'll go this way. Look at all the chandeliers. Goodness. I like how they name the streets. So when you're in here, if you get lost, you can look at the street. That was like the one I went in a couple weeks ago. You can look up at the street and say, meet me at um, Cherry Lane, where it's close to Oak Court. <laughs> look at these bottle stoppers. These are gorgeous. Wow. 26. They call them ornaments. I thought they were bottle stoppers. I have noticed. I used to get a lot. Not a lot, but a decent amount of silver from um, Goodwill. And somebody mentioned recently that they hadn't seen much lately. And they're right. I've been to mine and I can't find hardly any silver. This is a three-piece set, $85. But at the Goodwill, it's so cheap. And there's so much you can do with silver. We got some shoes, some coats, backpacks, some glass eggs, where it says alabaster eggs. Let's see. I wish you guys would do me a favor and invite your friends, family, neighbors, co-workers, whoever, to come visit our page. And the best way to know when we're going on live is to sign up for Telegram. That's so convenient. Well, I couldn't use that bow. I was thinking about getting another bow to make another bunny in, but that one's got too many ridges in it. This is my idea of relaxation. You can just come and spend hours. Look at this tree made out of the eggs. Isn't that cute? Darling. Look at that llama. He's so cute. And this is my favorite animal. I used to collect them. Koala bears. Do y'all remember that, um, Qantas Airlines, they used to have a, um, when I was in high school, so that tells you how long ago, they used to have a commercial where this little um, um, koala bear was sitting in a chair in a seat on the plane. And I forget what the first part, look at all these, the first part of it was, but the second part of it, he said, he would hold his little paws up by his face and he said, and even things for their paws. My friend and I in high school loved that. So every time we would see each other, we'd say, and even things for their paws. <laughs> hmm. Remember troll dolls? I used to collect those in high school too. 38 bucks. If we had only known then, what we know now, that you'd be able to get for stuff. We probably wouldn't have thrown it out so quickly. Chinese checkerboard. This is a cute rabbit. Look at him. He's a tarlin. $40. He is really sweet. Hey, Debbie Oakley. Okay, let's see. Everybody's got their little rabbit books and rabbit stuffed animals and rabbit toys out there. I love the troll dolls. Instead of my son when he was little, we had quite a... Me too. Me too. Remember, I used to brush their hair, and then I would braid their hair, and then I would take it out. It was crazy. I thought that was a real man standing there. <laughs> Funny. It's like 
They've got lots and lots and lots of books in there. Love this fabric. It's gorgeous. So much stuff, or my dad would say junk. <laughs> That's what he would call it. But why do you need this junk? So one person's trash is another person's treasure, Dad. He never got that. It's a cute rabbit right there, look. $27. That's cute. I would like to find some more of those small little silver, whatever they were, plates, platters, or whatever. 